<sighs> Yo, this dude never answered his door. I don't even understand why. Like, it's crazy. I just knock and knock and knock. He never answers his door. Let me text him real quick. Okay. Damn it, man. I guess I'll call him. I mean, how you gonna invite somebody over and then you don't even pick up your phone? You don't even, like, answer the door? Fine. I'll just call him real quick. And you ain't gonna pick up though. All right, man. Forget this. I'm busting in. Yo, you in there? Oh snap! Yo, I've been texting you for a minute, dog. You don't pick up your phone. What's what's up with that? What? No, I ain't get no text message. Look. I even called you. I've been knocking for like 10 minutes. You don't even pick up your phone. You never do. You invite me over here and you never do. I've just been playing the game. I can't hear anything. I can't hear you knocking. What do you mean you ain't get my text message? I sent it to you like a long time ago. You should have gotten it by now. I guess the call didn't go through. I mean, like, I don't have any text messages. Look, I have zero text messages for me. Nothing came through. What? No, at least the phone call. You should have gotten the phone call by now. And how are you just going to walk in my house? Yeah, I just walked in your house. You invited me. I've been sitting out there for 10, 15 minutes. You invited me. I'm coming in the house. I mean, you left it unlocked anyway, so. Look, I got nothing from you. If you want to stay, you can stay. But if you if you want to get the hell out of here, get the hell out of here. But don't just walk in my house. That's messed up, dude. All right, whatever, man. All right, so in case you haven't figured it out, I get bad signal uh, in the house i just do it i don't know if it's my room i don't know if it's the actual house but i do uh i can go outside and still get back sick bad signal behind my house um and i do have the carrier t-mobile for this um and my wife actually uh, called and complained about it so they said they'll send us out a personal cellular spot uh or a cell spot so this is what they send us out a t-mobile personal cell spot 4g lte cellular uh, device um, for this as far as I know we are just going to need our um, modem because apparently it runs through the uh, Wi-Fi or it runs through the internet off of our modem um, so let's take this apart um, so we can kind of see if this works because I am curious to see if this actually works there's a starter guy some kind of warranty and hopefully this actually does work and it um, lets us uh, get better signal because honestly I miss out on a lot of messages whenever um, whenever I, can, I don't get them in and I miss out on a lot of uh, a lot of notifications and also like if I'm trying to verify something you know how there's like two-step verification if I'm trying to send like a short code to myself to verify like a six pin digit code it sometimes doesn't even show up. So this is a very big problem for me. All right, here's the power supply. And that's that, there's that. Here's a, an antenna, Wi-Fi adapter, or not Wi-Fi adapter, ethernet cord and some screws. All right, so I kind of went through the quick start guide for this um, as fast as I could before actually starting this. And the first step that you have to do is connect the T-Mobile cell spot to your modem, to one of the ports on the back of the modem. So we're going to take the cable that they uh, included really quickly, unwrap this, you know, get rid of all this trash. And we're going to connect it to the one that says WAN on the back. It's gonna be a yellow, yellow uh, spot on the back of the uh, T-Mobile hot cell spot. I'm gonna connect it right there. This side's gonna to go to any of the ports on the back of your modem. Now, I, I, we have Verizon here in case that matters to you. I don't know if you have Verizon at your home, but um, Comcast should be the same way. Just connect it right through any of the ports on there. Okay. 
And power cord is going to go on the only power power slot on the back here. It actually says power on it. And now we're supposed to connect the antenna. Let me see. Mm. This is the antenna. So this actually goes stuck to a window. That's why I'm kind of next to a window right now. This is supposed to go to uh, the closest window. That way it kind of gets the signal from the back or uh, from the outside. All right, so the antenna for this is going to be right up here. Um, I assume this just plugs in. Oh, okay. So, yeah, it just kind of snaps in. That's good. Just kind of snaps in. So that is the GPS antenna. So it, so it knows your location, um, and it'll be able to deliver the signal to you. I'm not going to use the screws. I think this is so you can mount this on the wall. I'm going to put this by the window, which is the window is right here. And I think this is sticky, right? Yeah, that is uh, definitely a sticker, so you can just stick that to the window. And then this plugs into the uh, power. So let's find a power, power area to do this on. Okay, now that we have it plugged in, I did read in the quick guide that the whole entire setup is going to take about, it can take up to two hours. Um, because the uh, device itself has to um, connect to the network, has to update its firmware on its own, and then eventually it's going to um, um, be ready for you to use. So we're going to go ahead and wait the two hours, and um, or however long this is going to take, and then we're going to come back and see if, uh, how the signal is, if it improved at all, um, and hopefully it does. All right, so while waiting for this to load up, I decided to go ahead and uh, test the, uh, the signal of my phone in three different areas. Uh, the first one was the hallway uh, going up to upstairs. The second one was the laundry room. And the third one was this room here in my gaming area, just to kind of see how many bars I, I get. And honestly, let's see, for the hallway, I ended up getting about one bar. Uh, the um, laundry room again one bar in my room I was able to get up to three bars at times but it would actually go back down to one bar now I have seen it uh, uh, many times where I don't have bars at all um, so it kind of fluctuates up and down anywhere from zero to three um, so sometimes I may I may get a signal here and there but it's not a constant signal so uh, hopefully once this is up it'll change that um, uh, in the meantime um, I'm gonna go play some video games and be back while, once this is done. Okay, everybody, it's a new day. I actually completely forgot that I set this up yesterday um, while, I, while I was waiting for it. I went to go play video games, like I said, and I completely forgot about it. Um, I have it turned off right now, and I'll tell you why in a minute. But I, wh wh when it finally was on, um, everywhere I went in the house, I have full bars. It actually works. Uh, I, I got off my Wi-Fi. I, I went ahead and made a, a few phone calls and sent a few text messages, got a few me messages sent to me, and everything was working just fine. Everywhere in the house, I actually get signal now. So this thing actually, this thing works for 4G uh, LTE. It actually works. Uh, occasionally, the 4G LTE light does blink, which means I think the signal uh, is trying to establish the 4G LTE signal again, um, and that's actually what that means. So if you if you see this blinking at one point or another, if it's a solid light, it means that you are now receiving perfect uh, uh, signal from the 3G or the 4G LTE. If, uh, if it starts to blink, it's trying to establish the, um, the signal again. But I have one problem with this. Now, I already recorded this video. This is why it feels kind of rushed now. I recorded this, uh, this part of the video prior to me unplugging this, and it turns out that there is interference with my microphone on the camera. Um, while this is running. So this is why I have it off right now. So as soon as I plug it in, uh, it, it but does a buzzing noise. Like, you can hear it here. Testing audio with the device on. Can you hear a buzzing noise? Hmm. 
So after realizing that it's that it was gonna do that, um, I ended up unplugging it to kind of try to finish this video off. I'm gonna plug it back, plug it back in afterwards. But just a heads up, if you actually are uh, recording video or any kind of audio on a microphone, I haven't tested with multiple microphones, but at least the one on my camera, which is a Rode mic, um, it does pick up this interference and it will ruin the audio on your uh, video. So keep that in mind if you have one of these in the house. Um, now this is because this is because I'm I'm sitting next to it. If you go somewhere else in the house, further away, you can record. You should be able to record just fine. Um, so I have two options: either uh, move this over somewhere else in the house, um, or I will just disconnect it every time I try to make a video. I don't know, but <laughs> um, I just wanted y'all to know that. So, anyways, um, I hope this video was informative. Uh, to everyone that was kind of asking about this. I know not many people know that there is a person, a cell spot uh, available if you are having problems with your uh, with your signal on your phone at home. Just uh, go ahead and call your provider and see if they actually have one of these. Uh, I don't think they charged us for this. They just sent it out to uh, my wife after she called um, and now it's here. So I am gonna plug it in. I'm gonna, I'm gonna use it for a little bit longer, uh, but I think uh, I think I'm I'm happy with it so far. I do get signal and I do get my text messages and stuff, so that's amazing. So, anyways, if this video was helpful to y'all, make sure y'all subscribe. Make sure you share this video because again, not everybody knows that there a thing as a cell spot, personal cell spot that you can kind of put in your house. So, um, and uh, just 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 to recap, I'm I'm doing this for T-Mobile. I have uh, that's my carrier. Um, you have to check with your carrier to see if they have this available. But anyways. You know what I'm saying? Thanks again for watching. Take take care of yourself. Stay safe and take care of each other. I'll see you on the next one. It's crazy. Everywhere that I go, it's full. I was walking around and see you guys to show you that it doesn't move. Going into my room, it doesn't move. It's like. like okay well works now watch this I'm gonna unplug the cell spot right I'm gonna unplug the cell spot it's unplugged let's see how long it takes for it to realize oh crap I don't have any signal there you go there you go it's gone signal's gone again so it definitely works <laughs> it definitely works awesome